Okay, so quarter 4 na po tayo ng week 1, lesson number 1. At ang topic natin for today is exterior angle of a triangle. So, at the end of the session, you will be able to illustrate exterior angle of a triangle. So, let's start. When the sides of a triangle are extended, ayan, so, pag in-extend natin yung mga sides ng triangle, the other angles are formed. The original angles are the interior angles. So, yung angle 1, angle 2, and angle 3 are the interior angles. And for the angles that form linear pairs with the interior angles, these are the exterior angles. So, yung mga nakikita ninyong green color are the exterior angles. So, we have angle 4, angle 5, angle 6, 7, 8, and 9. So, now you know the difference between the interior angles and exterior angles of a triangle. Let us proceed with the theorems regarding exterior angles. If you extend one side of a triangle, an exterior angle is formed. An exterior angle forms a linear pair with the adjacent interior angle of the triangle. Remote interior angles are the two angles that are not adjacent to the exterior angle. So in this case, angle 4 is the exterior angle. Angle 1 and angle 2 are the remote interior angles. And angle 4 and angle 3 are linear pair. In the next figure, we can say that angle 5 is the exterior angle. Angle 8 and angle 7 are the two remote interior angles. And angle 6 and angle 5 are linear pair. So here on the second or on the next figure, interior angles are the following, angle 2, angle 3, and angle 4. The exterior angles naman dito sa figure na to are angle 1 and angle 6 together with angle 5. Ang vertical angles natin, angle 2 and angle 7 as well as angle 1 and angle 6. And the remote interior angles of angle 6 is angle 3 and angle 4. The remote interior angles of angle 5 are angle 2 and angle 3. While the remote interior angles of angle 1 are angle 3 and angle 4. Remember, the measure of an exterior angle of a triangle is equal to the sum of the measures of the two remote interior angles. So, this will be the exterior angle theorem. So, kung dito sa ating figure, we have the measure of angle 4 must be equal to the measure of angle 1 plus the measure of angle 2. So, babalikan natin yung topic natin na sum of the measures of the interior angles of a triangle, which is equal to 180 degree. So, here in the figure, we will be adding the three measures of angles, which are angle A, B, and C. To make it 180 degrees. And we also need this concept. The supplement postulate. Na kung saan yung 
If angle 1 and angle 2 form a linear pair, then angle 1 and angle 2 are supplementary angles. So, pag sinabing supplementary angles, their total must be 180 degrees. Okay, so let's do practice. So, dito sa ating given, we have the measure of angle V, which is 50 degrees, and the measure of angle L is 60 and we will be looking for the measure of angle A as well as the exterior angle. So, the measure of the exterior angle is 110 degrees because by the theorem itself, the, the measure of the exterior angle is the sum of the two remote interior angles. And the two remote interior angles on this figure are 50 degrees and 60 degrees. So, Adding together, we will be having 110 degrees as the measure of the exterior angle. And for the measure of the interior angle of angle A, so we just simply get the supplement of 110, which is 70 degrees. Another example or another exercise, dito, angle L is missing. So, ang angle S natin is 55 degrees. Ang angle U ay 85 degrees. So, again, we will be using the theorem the sum of the measures of all interior angles of a triangle is 180 degrees. So, from here, we can come up with uh, we can look for the measure of angle L at the same time the supplement of this angle. So, dito, makukuha na natin yung supplement ng 85 degrees. Makukuha natin yung exterior angle. And for this, angle L is 40 degrees. We come up with this. We add 85 and 55. The total will be subtracted from 180. So, the difference is 40 degrees. And to get the exterior angle, there are two possible methods. The, uh, the first method is using the supplement postulate. So, ibig sabihin, kukunin mo lang yung supplement ng 85 degrees. Or, the second method is you will just add 40 and 55. So, we will have being 95 degrees as the exterior angle. Next is, we will be completing the following table. So, we have the following given. The measure of angle 1 and the measure of angle 2 are 80 and 43 respectively. And we are looking for the measure of angle 3 and angle 4. So, in this case, let's apply what we've learned. So, the measure of angle 3 based on the figure will be 57 degrees. How come na naging 57 degrees? We just actually uh, get the total of this, 80 and 43, then subtract it to 180 degrees. That will give you 57. And for the measure of angle 4, since this is the exterior angle, we can add the measure of angle 2 and the measure of angle 3. Since they are both remote interior angles. So, 43 plus 57, that is 100 degrees. Or, you can simply get the supplement of 80 degrees. Next. So, on this second set, we have the measure of angle 2, which is 82 degrees. And the measure of angle 4 is 148. We'll be looking for the measure of angle 1 and the measure of angle 3. So, from here, since an exterior angle was given, we will be uh, looking for angle 1. So, dito, we can say or we can use the supplement postulate. So, get the supplement of 148 degrees. So, the supplement of 148 is 32 so, meaning the measure of angle 1 is 32, while the measure of angle 3, so from here, since 148 ito, we can subtract 148 
uh, and 82 since 2 and 3 are both remote interior angles. Or another way is we have to add the measure of angle 1 and angle 2 then subtract it to 180. That will give you the same answer which is 66. 66. And for the third set, okay, so the measure of angle 1 here is missing and we have the given of measure of angle 2 which is 69 3 is 56 and looking for measure of angle 4 so we have okay so to get the exterior angle which is the mesh of uh, the angle 4 we just simply add to uh, the measure of angle 2 and the measure of angle 3 so 69 plus 56 is actually 125 degree so, since 125 degrees is here, the exterior angle, and the supplement of 125 is 55. So, this is the measure of angle 1. And next for the fourth set, okay, so the measure of angle 3 is 40, and the exterior natin i 70. So, from here, we can say, or using the supplement, we can find the measure of angle 1. So, the supplement of 70 is 110. And for this, 110 minus 40, which is the measure of angle 3. And this is one of the interior or remote interior angles of the said figure. We can have measure of angle 2, which is 30 degrees. Let's have more practice. We apply naman natin in terms of algebra. Okay, so in this case, we will be uh, looking for the measure of angle BST. So here is the figure. So ibig sabihin, BST is the exterior angle. And angle E and angle B are both remote interior angles. So the, uh, the possible solution for this is we need to solve for the value of x. Remember that the measure of an exterior angle is equal to the sum of the measures of the two remote interior angles. So if we will put it on an equation, the measure of angle BST is equal to the measure of angle B plus the measure of angle E, just like what I've said a while ago. And let's substitute the given to the equation. So 2x minus 5 is equal to x plus 70. And by subtraction property of equality and addition property of equality, we can come up with the new equation, which is 2x minus x is equal to 70 plus 5. And 2x minus x is x. And 70 plus 5 is 75. So the value of x is 75. And for that, gagamitin natin yung value ng x sa given expressions para makuha natin ang sukat ni BST, ni angle BST. So, in other words, ang sukat ni B ay 75 since yun po yung ating expression for in, uh, angle B. So, for the measure of angle BST, we will be substituting or we will be substituting uh, the value of X na naobtain natin kanina from this expression. So, 2 times 75 minus 5. That will give you 145. So, yan po yung sukat ng angle BST, 145. Okay, so let's have another. Find the measures of each angle. Okay, so kung makikita ninyo, 3x minus 70 is the exterior angle and these two uh, angles are both remote interior angles. So, tulad lang ng ginawa natin kanina, let's put let's put it into an equation. So, remember po, uh, the sum of the two remote interior angles will be the measure of the exterior angle. 
So, we have 3x minus 70 is equal to 25 plus x plus 15. So, isi-simplify po natin. Ayan. Then, we have 3x minus x. Paano nangyari yun? We have to subtract uh, minus I mean, we have to apply the subtraction property of equality and addition property of equality to get the new set of equation. Ayan na po siya. So, isi-simplify pa po natin. 3x minus x, that is 2x, and then add together the three numbers here. So, 2x is equal to 110. And by division property of equality, so, ang value ng x natin is 55. And then, itong value ng x na to, isa-substitute lang natin siya sa given expressions. So, let's start with the exterior angle. Ang exterior angle natin ay 3x minus 70. So, substitute lang natin siya doon. So, 3 times 55 minus 70. So, 165 minus 70 is 95 degrees. So, yun po yung sukat ng exterior. Ngayon, para makuha yung isang interior dito, isa substitute lang din ulit natin. So, x plus 15. So, yung value ng x na nakuha natin kanina is 55. So, 55 plus 15, 70 degrees. Okay, so remember the exterior angle inequality theorem. The measure of an exterior angle of a triangle is greater than the measure of either of its remote interior angles. Take note, greater than. So let's see of this. Dahil alam natin na yung sukat ng exterior angle ay mas malaki sa isa sa mga to na interior angle. Ayan, we can come up with this inequality theorem. So, measure of angle 4 is greater than the measure of angle 1. Or, measure of angle 4 is greater than the measure of angle 2. So, in this example na nakuha natin kanina, 110 degrees is the exterior angles, and the two remote interior angles are 50 and 60. So, kung mapapansin ninyo, 110 is greater than either of the two. Same with this. So, 95 is the exterior, and this 95 degrees as the, as the exterior angle is greater than uh, 40 degrees or 50 de 55 degrees. Ayan. So, yan, dyan po nagtatapos ang ating discussion about exterior angle of a triangle.